Station 101 WRF. The Rampage Meltdown here in Taylor at Heritage Park for Rocktoberfest. You guys ready for Slash or what? They're here, they're ready to go. Guys, welcome to the stage, Slash. Well, nice to see it down here in uh, Taylor, man. And uh, I got to tell you, we were just talking about this uh, just a few minutes ago. The whole new generation of fans you're reaching. I told you my son was here because he's seen you on cartoons. Right, um, the, the Phineas and Ferb thing. Yeah. Yeah, well, those guys are friends of mine. I know the, the two artists that created it, and they asked me if I would do it, and I was like, uh, you know, I love being animated. It's awesome. <laughs> so we had a good time, and that song that I performed on that was like a real band, you know, like a real rock and roll band, which they never use on TV, uh, so it was pretty cool. You're also talking about, uh, just a few minutes ago backstage here, that Brian Wilson is your neighbor across the street. That's so wild. Well, I mean, I, I was telling you that. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean, I didn't mean to, to, to spread well, that I know, surprise. Well, I've noticed that anything I say is, just spreads, you know, over the net. All right, that's not true then. It's not true. Don't worry. Don't pretend you didn't hear that. So, so how's things going on this tour? Uh, everything's going great, man. I'm looking forward to the gig tonight, I'll tell you that much. But it's been the most kick-ass tour. It's been, uh, I was, I, I, words can't describe. Now, I think uh, last time you, we saw you here, uh, actually did that acoustic set in Royal Oak, and that was really cool as well. Yeah, that was cool. But, I mean, at that point, it was Miles and... and uh, we had a couple original songs, and the rest of the stuff was like from Guns and from the you know other other singers from the solo record. You know, he was singing all the songs. Now we have an original record, so it's just a really, really great feeling. It's been really well received. Slash keeps backing up a little bit. All his it's feedback. Back, here I yeah. Am. yeah, there you go. We're trying to get it cleared up as uh, we talk here. But uh, anyways, yeah. Um, plus on that last one too, uh, Kid Rock was on there from uh, Michigan. Yeah. So how was it working with uh, Rock? You stayed up at his place for a little while, didn't I you? I did. I actually I just texted him to see if he's in town. He's he's awesome. Yeah, and yeah. we had a blast, man, working on that song with him. It was great because I got to see how he works as a songwriter, and he's got a, he's just a, he's got a great work ethic, and he uh, he rules his roost. <laughs> <I'll tell you. laughs> I don't know if we want to tell everyone what he was doing, but he, uh, yesterday he told me that the record was done and he was out hunting. Oh yeah, probably. <laughs> Uh, you know, a couple. <laughs> uh, one of the coolest things I've ever seen. I've been in this business for 20 years. You came in with the Metallica Guns and Roses tour. You pulled into the limo. You got out with Duff McKagan, Snake Sabo, and the limo, the limo trunk opened up, and you pulled your guitar out of there. I thought that was like the coolest thing ever. Well, because there was no room in the car. No room in the car, huh? No, not enough guitars on stage. Well, I like to keep something with me at all times. Is that right? I was going to ask you about that. You like to just fiddle around and. I, well, you know, I'm on the road a lot, right? So I keep my, my, I take my guitar with me, you know, to my room, and I record in there, and it sleeps on the bed with me when the wife's not in town. So. <laughs> <laughs> now uh, let's talk a little bit about the uh, social network thing. I know you tweet a lot. You even got your little uh, picture there at the end of your tweets. You like doing that? Um, it's a good way to put information out so that people know exactly from the horse's mouth what's happening. And I, I, that's actually one of the, the, the advent of social networking as far as for being a musician who's traveling a lot, just to get information out is, is priceless. Awesome. Well, Slash is here. Let's crank out something new from Slash as we are live down here at Taylor Rocktoberfest 101 WRIF The Rift. Hey, this is Slash, and you're watching 101 Rip. <laughs> Sorry, one more time. Hey, this is Slash, and you're watching 101 Rip, Detroit. 